Imagine this, switching on your lights using your mobile phone or even locking your door. And why not try preparing tea and getting security alerts every time someone opens your door? Sounds like something out of a spy movie. Truly amazing. But how does it all work? You see how it's operating? It's now to switch off the right and now go back to the resting position. That is how it's able now to activate and operate. Mora has assembled his circuit from salvage electronic components to operate the system. When he is within the house, Mora uses a remote control to run the system. If I press my button, you can see how it is able to activate this uh, sensor and is able now to take back those signals to my door and uh, the door is closed. Connected to the whole system is a mobile phone. This enables him to run the system while he's away from the house. It has been able to confirm to my phone that uh, there is somebody who has interfered with my remote control. So whatever, maybe, so maybe I'm in town, I'm able now to see that there is something that has really gone on in my house. But the most amazing of his innovations is a tea maker which is connected to the system. The ingredients of the tea are already pre-arranged, thus all one has to do is make a phone call using his mobile phone. Even more impressive is the updates that Maura receives every time you activate the system. For most Kenyans, technological innovations are a of foreigners, but emerging talent such as Moora could make Kenya a regional powerhouse in ICT-related services. But if nothing is done to encourage these inventors, their dreams may remain just that, pipe dreams. Henry Gedaiga, Citizen News.